Four seven eleven Eau de Cologne. That has a particular resonance for me because I'm number seven out of a family of eleven. Four boys, seven girls. Both my parents were doctors. We lived in Longford for a short period of time and then moved to Donnybrook. But every summer we spent down in Lusk on the family farm. And those are the days that I remember the best and certainly have the fondest recollections of. I went to school in various schools, but I suppose Ring stands out. I was there for two years where I learned the Cúpla Fuckle, I got to help Jogón in uh, Fósagum. And I went to Gormeson for five years, so I spent a lot of my youth actually in the countryside rather than in the city. When I left school, I went to the College of Surgeons, where I had a very good time, as most students do. And, however, toward the end of my time there, I became a bit disillusioned with the hierarchy of medicine and would have chucked it in. Only my father advised me that if I did at that point in time, I would just be a failed medical student. So I did finish my training. And when I started to work as a doctor, I found I really had found my true vocation. Uh, I think if you enjoy people, which I do, you'll enjoy dealing with them and helping them. And certainly general practice is where I found that I got the most satisfaction. So I suppose it's not an unnatural leap to go from there into politics, which again is an area where there's a lot of contact with people, listening to people, understanding their problems and doing your best to help and advise. And I've been very happy to have become involved in politics. It's not where I ever expected to end up, but uh, having arrived here, I'm very pleased to be in a position to influence policy in this country in terms of how it's going to affect our day-to-day -day lives. I'm married to Dorothy. We have five children, one of whom is qualified as a doctor and another who's training as a doctor. And I'm delighted that they're following in that tradition of what I believe is helping people, listening to people and healing. But I hope you'll also see them out with me very soon. And in fact, they've been out with me already on the doors looking for your support. And I look forward to seeing you on the doors and listening to your problems and helping in whatever way we can. That's it. Mm -hmm.